strawberry clock is king of the portal. Alrighty. What do we got here? Barbarian Bob. I don't recognize this one either. A lot of mysteries tonight. I know. But... But look at that face of determination. I know, he's ready to fucking go. No, I mean on the shield. Oh, yeah, my mistake. Yeah, the little skull there. The shield's ready to go. Games of Gondor. Uh, Games of Gondor was another good um, mm -hmm. publisher, whatever. Um, options. Baby mode. High quality. High quality. High quality. Actually, can you change those key bindings? Nope. They're, they're just clickable for looks. Yeah. To make you think you have options. Mm -hmm. Attack, block, jump. Okay, we got it. Time to bust out the joy key. You want me to just get the other keyboard? Yeah. Pause, guys, pause. Why did I pass away? Got it. Can you solve the mystery? Dude! Okay, you wanna see how awkward this is? How is it? I these buttons do not work on your numb lock, but this one does. These buttons don't work on your arrows, but this one does. Meaning I can play the game this way. Jump, block, attack. The question how much of that is my keyboard and how much of it is the game. Just fucking around with it. Quit fucking around with it because I'm about to unplug the keyboard. Doesn't matter, I died. This is all going in, by the way. Oh, seriously? Keyboard's unplugged. I can't fight any barbarians now. I think you're the only barbarian who will. Oh. You know, Bob. Oh, yeah. You know, I'm looking at this, and I'm fucking with this, and I'm starting to think... Jesus Christ. Well, that's another... Well, well that keyboard don't work. No, it's still installing. Oh, my God. Because I use a different USB slot, so it needs to reinstall it every single time. Guys, we are installing drivers live. This is the kind of quality you don't get from other channels. Is the keyboard installed yet? No. This might be our best bit yet. <laughs> How do I know I, when the keyboard's installed? Uh, try moving now. Nope. Oh, there we go. I'm in. I'm in. The keyboard's installed. At least it's not all shenanigans. Freaking hour and a half trying to, uh... Fix it. Use your strategy. I'm starting to remember this game. Yeah, the more I'm fucking with this, the more I'm re definitely remembering this. Look at that handsome man of the statue. I know! I was looking at that just now. Come down here, you fucking idiot. Ow! Don't slash my neck! What is your most fashionable part? I need to wear a gorget. It's always gorgeous for me. Yeah. Oh. Amazing how they immediately skeletonize. Oh fuck! This guy got a got a. He has a sling. Stop it! Well, he stopped it. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! Oh. Oh, look at that elite mob. Fuck elite mobs. I'm getting the fuck right out of here. Oh man, I blocked from every fucking angle. How's that working? Uh, pretty good. I'm gonna hit somebody eventually. Someday. Somehow. You're gonna make it alright. But not right now. Oh fuck! He made me dead! He flowered Damn you. Damn it, alright Levi, click replay. I will click the replay for you because I have the mouse. You do. Okay. Alright, dickhead. I'm coming right. in and I'm breaking your castle up. You're back to three bobs. You don't know you're running out of bobs. I forgot what the buttons were. Come 
Combat don't got a lot going on, but that's okay. Some would say it would have too much going on. Some would, but some would be wrong. Anything funny? You can tell me about this. So, Damn it! About this game. So the artist was the BBQ. Okay. And uh, Scribble Style was the game programmer. So this was a joint project. Whatever happened to uh, those guys? I don't know. I think they might have been involved with the remake of Barbarian Bob. There's a remake of Barbarian Bob. There's a remake of Barbarian Bob, but it's I believe it's past the Best Buy date. What do you mean? Uh, the cutoff date for our games. Oh. Uh, and this one was released in April 29, 2005. I am... Definitely sure that I played this game, and I'm sure that I sucked at it then just as much as I do now. Killing the same three you're, dudes over and over again. You're doing the best you can with what you have. Fuck! I'm going past. Nope. Can't. Oh, you got me. Damn it! One more time, one more time, one more time. I'm gonna kill all these fucking guys. Kill him dead. That's what Bob would have wanted. All oh, my dead Bobs. Okay. This guy. Don't stand a fucking chance against me. Good. Okay. Yeah, you really gotta wipe out the Salmon people. Yeah. Oh man, is Bob a racist? No, he's a barbarian. So yes. Bob barbarian. Bob ba barbarian. You know I never fucking watched that show, but I've always loved it. But the that intro song. is amazing, yes. The fucking intro. The one good bit that I've seen from it is Thinking quickly, Dave constructs a, a megaphone using a squirrel, some string, and a megaphone. Yeah. And he holds it up into a megaphone with a squirrel just tied to it. Yeah, I love that. There are other good bits from that show. I just didn't really watch it. Sister did. Sister watched that a lot. Mm -hmm. that, that seems to be more in her age range. Yeah. You know, she's not much younger than me, though. Mm. Seems to be more in her age range. <laughs> a fierce back and forth. How do I fight you? Well. Apparently you don't. Yeah, not like that. This is definitely the best I've done so far. This guy is so gonna kill me. Can he hit you if you're standing directly on top of him? I don't know. It's not something I want to try. I've only got one hit point. Well, you're, you're running out of other options. You're right. Damn it! Oh, fucking asshole. That guy wins. That guy's Barbarian Bob. Piece of shit, dickhead. Well, Barbarian Bob is okay. I bet the remake is good. Is mm. is is better. The combat was pissing me off. Yeah, we should check out Bulwark Bob some point. Seriously? No. Don't do these things to me. You oh. know how gullible I am. I will always do these things to you. It's too easy. So you already saw this one coming. Yeah, you know, I really should have. Because you kept talking about it. I do keep talking about it. I didn't think we'd actually play the Flash version of it. I thought that if we were going to end up playing it, that we'd end up playing the um, the console version, which is advertised right here. Mm -hmm. And uh, we definitely should. Uh, even if we don't record it, we should just play it for ourselves. But Only twenty nine ninety five. dollars ho, 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 yeah. That's definitely how much it is now. Uh, Look at this tutorial. I know. Alrighty. Alright, that's it. That's how you play the video game. Yeah, that's how you play the game. Man, this music direction. It's Fat Kid. Now, here's, here's what I do. Don't kill the Fat Kid. 
JK, kill the fat kid. Mm -hmm. ah, ha, ha. I'm dead already. <laughs> yeah, that's how you play the game. You uh, play and you die already. It doesn't even show up in the first screen in Dad and Me as well. Um, uh, I don't know. Well, if not the first, like early on. House of Damn Newt. House of Newt. So this was originally released in August 7th, 2002. The, the PS2 game was November 18th, 2004. Oh my god, I'm bad at this fucking game. No, that's just how it is. It's just hard as shit? Yeah. Damn it! Yeah, I die a lot. I almost didn't put this on here for this exact reason. Because it's hard as hell? Yeah. Oh, like, fuck! It's the kind of difficulty that makes me think of the old Ren Stimpy games, for all, of all things. Really? Yeah. What just killed me? Game over I'm already. FBI agent? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there he is right there. Kill the fat kid. Alright, let's keep moving. Keep moving right into that bullet. Well, yeah. Damn it! Enron! An Enron joke. That's how you know it's 2002. Yeah. Oh, man. This game is super good, though. I mean, obviously, the actual fucking. Um, the oh, actual console game is better. But. Alright, I feel a little more now. Well, I was. So we got the heavy hitters here. We got Dan Paladin, Tom Fulp, and also FDA, the new music. You know what? It's, you know what? I've fought this guy so many times that I remember his pattern just like perfectly. <laughs> Boy, it's gonna be really embarrassing when you get hit. Watch me. Okay. It makes you think of the boss of that one Batman game. Fuck! <laughs> yes! The Batman game on the second Genesis? Yeah, the one that you made me play. It's impossible. There we go. Only only hit once. Oh, I pressed the shoot button instead of the jump button. Oh, you got a two for one. Ooh, almost, almost. Do FBI agents keep a heavy stock of grenades around? These guys do. The ones I mean, that are ready to fight the fucking aliens yeah, do. I was about to say, maybe the FBI agents that deal with aliens. You know the ones. Was this at the Men in Black came on? Oh yeah, Men in Black yeah. was 1997, dude. Yeah, yeah, it was 90s, wasn't it? In fact, it probably would have been after Men in Black 2, even. Hmm. The one that I still really like, even though it's garbage. Yeah. Damn! Well, you managed to get past the first boss. You want to give it one more try? Yeah, you can if you want. I want to give it one more try. Whoa! What the? Oh, man, look at the art in that. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Dude, the console game is so fucking good. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. So, the console game is actually kind of interesting to me because... No, I didn't want to kill the fat kid this time! Oops. It's just so easy to murder this child. I know. Oh, I'm getting fucked this time. What are we saying? Because it was an indie game on a major console back in 2004. You I know, that just didn't happen. Yeah, it didn't happen. Like, Cave Store didn't come up for a few years, a few years after that, and I consider that the beginning of the indie wave we're going through right now. I know. You got a lot to, to uh... You got a lot to, uh... Oda Alien Hominid right here. Also, the game's fucking great, so there's that. Even this is great as impossible as it is. Well, shit, wait, I just flew right through that last part. I'm just gonna spin my arms and close my eyes. And if <laughs> it, and I'm start walking towards you. Whatever so happens, it, happens. So if anything happens, it's your fault. Ooh, jumped down. Mm -hmm. Damn.
Look at that action pose. Got him. All right. Ugh! Right in the grill. Ooh, got him in the dick. Fart apartments. You know, they put their bad jokes here at the end because they didn't expect anybody to get this far. They what just killed me? They should have called it a fart mix. Yeah, that's a way better joke. All right, this is it. This is it. This is it. You approach him like you were approaching a heart attack. This is it. This is it. This is the one. Damn. All right, well. That game is fucking great, but, you know, I'm not getting any further than that. Well, you got further than I expected. I got further each time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that just makes me want to go buy Alien Hominid. Oh, man, looking at that artwork, it's all coming back to me, man. That game was fucking great. Uh, look forward to us eventually doing that game. Mm -hmm. Have fun being at the controls for that one. Oh, it's going to be amazing. What are we looking at? This is the Dark Cut. Or just Dark Cut. Dark Cut! Oh my god, I played the fuck out of Dark Cut. Mm hmm. Uh, this is, um. What the fuck is that fucking stupid surgeon game that I always lost that called? Trauma Center. Trauma Center. This is Trauma Center, but in the past. Yeah, this is, uh, Medieval. Did, but it came out after Trauma Center. It did. It's, it's, this is like Trauma Center, just like, um, Detective, Detective Grimoire was just Phoenix Wright. Yep. Yeah, that's a good thing. I didn't have a DS to play those games, so I played these. All right. This is oh yeah, listen to that music. It's great. Right. Careful, you don't want to injure okay. him by sliding, uh, misclicking the okay arrow keys. So he okay. gives you the instructions up right up there at the top. Uh, you you want to uh, keep the teeth on there. And Jesus, I fucked that up. All right. Shove soap in there. Clean the area. You know the, this the, is the not nice, medieval. The nice bar of soap. It's gotta be... Uh, you gotta, you gotta be good with the timing. Uh, Alternating arrow keys. There we go. He might survive. He might not. He only has ten, 11 hit points left. Here you go. Oh, you missed it. You took 10 damage. Yeah, that... Yeah. There are some ways to just not avoid causing damage to him. Like, wow, well, why did that damage him? <laughs> Ow, my feather. You gotta, keep, you gotta keep it steady. It goes really fast, dude. I know. And I... He is so dead. He's yeah. even more dead than he was before. Yeah. God. Well, it's because of this. Just slow and steady now. That's why I think the speed is affected by how long you hold the R key for. I think you're right. Out of that time. There we go. All right, out. Timing. Okay. Now wiggle it. He appreciates the wiggles. <laughs> okay. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Yeah, just put your initials. You'll live. Put your initials in there while you're doing it. Phew. Next. Remove these weird bolts from this individual. These weird boils. Boils, sorry. We were feeling it's some kind of new disease. Use any net means necessary to cleanse, remove, and eliminate the problem. Uh, da, 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 da. You'll be alright. The vinegar. You're fine. Just like Daniel would have done in the old world. What? He really hates vinegar. No, you, you, uh, yeah, you started too far into it. I see what you mean. Oh, uh, you got splashed in the E. This is the big one. It's a big one. 
Oh. On the buboes. I love that it says buboes. A lot of people don't know that's why it's called the bubonic plague, because it makes buboes. Mm. Today I learned. We're gonna get all this yucky pus out of there for you. Just save that for later. We're gonna let you bleed it out. Dig it deeper, just to throw it away. We don't really need these leeches no more, dude. They're looking pretty full. Yeah, they were some hungry boys, but they'll be all right now. Chris Cross. They'll be feeling better in no time. Yeah, look at you. You look great. Look, your boobos are going right the fuck yeah, away. A nice hot bath, some warm chicken soup, and you'll live to the ripe old age of 35. Yeah, you'll be fine. That chicken soup's going to dribble right out of his neck wound, though. All right, who's next? Oh, yeah, oh the, the vampire. vampire. Because this is so stupid because there's zero reason why you would ever fail this. Really? Yes. Like, if you accidentally kill your patient, it's like, uh... Oops, I accidentally killed the vampire. Oh, one false move will likely be your death. Alright. Hmm. What am I supposed to do? I... I press space. Mission complete. Alright, and then you stitch in the garlic. Gotta get that garlic in there. Gotta get it to precise points. And then we sew them back up. Alrighty. Okay, we're gonna chop your head off, you fucking idiot. Like... Oh, what? I messed up my patient! Oh no, my... Why? Oh, okay. Oh, I accidentally clicked restart. Oh no, but I want to fucking kill the vampire! I guess we'll never kill the vampire. You chop his head off. You stake him in the heart, you sew the garlic in him, you chop his head off. That is. And then I think you anoint him in holy water. I think it's the last thing you <laughs> and do. And that's the end of the game. And then that's it. Yeah, that is the last surgery, so. Yeah, that game was a lot of fun. Uh, what do you have to say about this game, Levi? Uh, released August 29, 2006, at the Trauma Center, obviously. Yes. By JMTB02. Yeah, that name Armageddon. sounds familiar. Because he also made Achievement Unlocked. Oh. Okay. Do you have anything else to say about this? Uh, not really. The sequel? Uh, right, there was a sequel. But there was a sequel. Release had to cut off date, so I didn't right. look too much into it. I played that one a lot as well. Um, that one was set during the Civil War. Ah. Um, so there are moments where, like, uh, if you remember in, like, Trauma Center, you had access to, like, uh, not, not, not the gel, but the serum you could inject into your patient to bring their life back up a little bit. Yeah. Um... Is they it whiskey? It, it absolutely was whiskey. Because why wouldn't it be whiskey? Of course it would. Yeah, you could give him some whiskey. Uh, there was also, at some points, you um, you would have to, like... Like, you know how I showed you you had to cut... Uh, or you saw you had to, like, anoint, mount the holy symbol. Yep. Right? Yeah. Um, things that are, like, kind of innocuous that aren't actually surgery on the patient. Or, like, cutting mm -hmm. the tails off the... Uh, you had to put the bullet in their mouth. For them to bite down on. Mm. Get ready! Because I'm about to saw your fucking leg off and then clean it off on my boot. Alright. Yeah, Dark Cut's great. This is a real good one. If you don't have access to Trauma Center, because mm -hmm. that's hard to and find, hey, if hard you, to find if, anymore. If you want to see Danny, go play it yourself. Yeah, go you, go fucking kill that vampire. Chop his fucking head off. It's great. Because he's totally a vampire. He's the, That's a real-life vampire. 